Welcome to Johnny on Energy. We're here at the AHR Expo in Dallas, and I'm here with Vince Cavaceno from General Tools and Instruments, and he's got some really cool stuff to show us today that I think you're going to be pretty excited about. The next product that I would like to cover is our new line of thermal imaging cameras, the GTI 10, 20, 30, and 50. Um, these are very unique or um, I should say they're really pretty cool devices that allow you to develop a thermal picture of a piece of equipment, of a duct, of a pipe, or even of a wall, or any other surface that you're interested in taking and learning what the temperature profile is of that. Uh, the principle behind the operation of this device is that every surface emits an IR signal. And this device picks up the IR signal. A warmer object will, um, will emit a higher level of radiation, and a cooler item, a cooler surface, will emit a lower level of radiation. So what this device will do is it will, you can use it to check the different level of heat over a surface. Um, it's focusable. In order to get the most accurate reading, you need to focus the, uh, the lens. And then you can see, and by looking at the screen, you'll see that the images where it's a hotter section, for example, this gentleman's face is um, a whiter color, and the shirt is a darker color. And so the spectrum of, um, of, of heat emission is what you're reading from here. The other couple of neat applications that this um, device has is that you can, you can pre-select certain spots on the screen that you want to measure. measure. So if you've got a wall that you want to see and you want to look at it over a period of time, and you want to see what these two temperature, what these two spots are over time, you can measure that. The other neat thing about this device is that it's got a minimum and maximum point reading. And that will travel around, it will pick, them, it'll pick the, either the hottest or the coldest spot that you're reading, and it will move around focus on that. So if you're looking at a wall and you want to find out where the hottest spot in the wall is, this uh, indicator there will show what, what it is. Some of the other neat, neat applications of this device is its ability to do what's called picture in picture. So right now we had it on the IR only setting. And what you can do is you can set it so that you get a visible, essentially like a camera, like a video camera, or you can do essentially a picture in picture, which would set it up so that if you're in a situation where you want to see, in order to get an accurate reading, you need to frame the section that you're reading around this environment. You can t get a, a, a regular video picture, a, a regular ordinary picture, and then the thermal image will be in the middle. Oh, that's awesome. I've never seen that before. That's a really cool feature. Some of the other things that are interesting with this, too, is that, um, I'm just going to turn this around for a second, is that it has the ability to, um, it has a, a laser pointer that will point to uh, an area on a wall so that if you want to set it up so that you measure exactly one spot, that can do that. It also has a flashlight, essentially, so if you're going into a dark room where you are not sure what's there, it will light up the room and allow you to work in an area that's lighted, which might have been previously dark. It's a pretty nice tool. Um, and as I said, it comes in four models from a plain vanilla uh, GTI 10, which does, not have the, which does not have the camera. It has the laser pointer. It's got a fixed lens, all the way up to the GTI 50, which has interchangeable lenses, so that if you've got a long distance uh, measurement that you want to make, you can put a long distance uh, telephone photo lens on this and, and really zoom it in uh, quite a distance. So a lot of options kind of meet the need that you're going for in your business or, you know, your use. Exactly. Um, the other things that are interesting about this is that the battery pack is sort of a standard lithium battery pack. Uh, some of the other items out there um, have proprietary batteries. This is a battery pack you can probably get at most electronic stores. And that's pretty convenient. The other thing is that from an output standpoint, you can record your image Images on an SD card, or you can export them to a computer via USB line. That's great. So you can ultimately get it over to your computer, save those images, look at them, show them to a client, you know, whatever need you have for that. And this acts like just a regular camera. And it looks pretty rugged. <laughs> it's quite rugged. Uh, the items are saved in like a JPEG format. So, the okay. so it's the GTI. This one is the GTI 30.